Hello, it is Saturday, January 14th, 2012 at 5.25 a.m. Central Standard Time. There's just a couple things ha happening here on radar that I wanted to show you. Well, there's more than a couple things happening, but I want to focus in on, and it's not right showing right here, but when I zoom in it will in um, Kansas, Wichita, Kansas, we've got kind of a spinning thing going on with the, um, the heaviest part going south. And Texas is lit up and so is this part of Oklahoma. And then additionally we've got some interesting clouds building over here. We just had a kind of a session of snake clouds yesterday and into this past evening, but now they've quit, but now we've got something new happening. And then also we've got, um, I don't know, they're just green clouds, <laughs> but they, they're moving strangely and they've just kind of been creeping up the coast here. And now they're kind of disappearing off radar. So let's go look at Florida first. And you can see that um, whatever's down here gener is generating this cloud. It's not a weather system because my cursor's not moving and so that dot's not moving either. So something's putting out um, whatever it takes to build clouds. And this one over here, it stays for a while too. See? And then it breaks away. Let me zoom in so we can look at this closer. I'm going to wait till it starts. See right there? It stays. Oh, let's see. Ah, let's go frame by frame. I wasn't going to do this. Because everything takes so long to upload. But that's all right. Maybe I'll find something else as I'm waiting for it, huh? Well, we want to go backwards. Let's go backwards. Get it back down here. See, it's our, at the beginning of the loop, it's already stationary, and that's at 821 on January 14th. It's just holding there. There it goes. It broke loose. So till 856, and then it breaks loose. See that? Sits there, sits there, sits there. We're going backwards. Now going forward. And then it breaks away. So we've got two, two areas that are generating clouds down here. And then going over to Kansas, you can see the spinner thing going. See right here with a heavier area going south. And this is all lit up in here too. These must be, I'm guessing these are probably wind farms. This one I'm pretty sure is. And then looking at the um, next red loop. Maybe. <laughs> Come on. There we go. See, so the heavier the heavier action's going south, and then it quits. It's the beginning of the loops like at seven and it ends about eleven UTC. Looks like it f quits flashing around 8, 8.30, although it was flashing when it started, so who knows how long it's been going exactly. And then um, the base velocity, that's what this is, and there's no precipitation there. Um, we did get a echo tops, I think, was it was. Whatever that means, there's a little spot of echo tops. <laughs> and, um, so that's it for that. I didn't um, run the loop in the green clouds, so let's go find them, see if we can. They're kind of running off the radar, though, so yeah, that's not a good one. Let's go look at the 2KM. Need something in the water here. Yeah, that one there, maybe. Oh, look at that. Sunlight's coming. <laughs> Time to go to bed. Yeah, see, they're they're just kind of snaking up, and they're they're kind of stringy, and they're pointed at the end. There's quite a few of them. They're snaking up here along South Carolina, North Carolina. 
And I assume they came out of the Gulf. But I, when I first saw them, I, I couldn't tell. They were already out. They've already gotten out of the hole. <laughs> so anyway, that's the end of my watch. Um, I pray someone else will take over during the daylight hours. Good night and God bless you. Or good morning, actually.